congratulations on your opportunity to see an instant increase in sales. You made a good choice in watching this video. In this video, you'll learn a process that I call getting it all done that will show you how one Honda store increased sales from 300 to over 400 cars in one month. This video is for dealer principals, general managers, GSM, sales managers, BDC managers who want to learn how to increase sales, profit, and productivity, but without the need to work more hours or increase your stress levels. This video is not for people who are addicted to clutter, chaos, and want to work more hours for the same pay and the same results. Also, if you're a manager that doesn't value your people, your employees' families, or your employees' mental health, then just stop watching this right now. My name is Sean Kelly, the CarBiz Coach, and I help automotive leaders achieve great results through people and technology with a unique approach to coaching. Why should you listen to me? Well, I used to run one of the top dealerships in my local market and leveraging coaching, we were able to take my store to set first time regional records and became the only store up in a down market for two consecutive years. And we almost completely eliminated turnover at my dealership by leveraging coaching. And once I realized that my mission in life wasn't to break through records at my dealership, but to bring coaching to the car business, I promoted seven people on my amazing team and then left them. And I began working with car dealers and automotive technology companies from coast to coast, all the way across the country. And since then, I've been voted consultant of the year by dealershipnews.com and voted number 10 sales coach by ambition.com. Um, this isn't about me, this is about the people I coach. And as a coach, I only succeed when my clients succeed. So after thousands of measurable and documented client coaching wins, from coast to coast over the last few years, this is one of my favorite recent wins that I wanna share with you because of the huge positive impact it had on this dealership's team. And it's best if you just hear it from their mouth. What are you most proud of accomplishing over the last six months? Um, you know, the last quarter we had a goal of hitting a thousand cars. So I guess to cut your six months and a half, you know, we had to build some little things to get their little wins to get to that point. Um, and, that, and we accomplished it. One of the top ones is time management. You know. That's one of the biggest problems we have in this business. And we kind of helped us focus on individually all the way down, you know, to from the from the bottom salesperson up to skip the general manager. He was involved in as well. You know, so we we definitely focus on what do we do in a day, um, not just come in and get distracted. Um, so that that piece allows the salespeople to be a little bit more proactive during their time. Um, so definitely a big piece. Uh, the video email, um, you know, we made sure that every web lead is getting a video response. Um, you know, whether you're sitting on the couch at home. Uh, you know, whatever it is, you know, would like to send it from the lot in front of the car, let them see that car exists. Um, but we wanted to make sure that, you know, right away we're sending video, video response um, definitely made a big difference for us. Did you know the average sales manager has well over 17 hours of work to do each day in order to completely do their job to its fullest capacity? This creates a situation where managers go home frustrated that they didn't get what they want accomplished. And even worse, this causes them to have stagnant results. You know, it's no wonder NADA claims that the total net profit share of sales for dealerships is stagnant at 2.3% for the last few years. That's why I want to give you this amazing tool that was a game changer for me and my dealership and for Jay and his dealership and for sales leaders that we coach across the country, of course, it's only one of many tools we leverage to grow dealers results, but this will be one of the cornerstones for your immediate sales growth and future success. So get ready to get it all done. Step one, first, you need to take activity inventory. That's right. Activity inventory is just like, you know, your used car inventory at your dealership, except the inventory is are your activities and the floor plan ceiling is the time you have in the day. Not knowing where all your activities you do throughout the day is the equivalent of having a used car dealership and not knowing where all the cars are. So first and foremost, um, after you document everything you do, write down um, what's missing, right? Um, what activities do you wanna be doing more of, but you can't because you just can't seem to find the time or you just forget to do it because other things get, get in the way. Um, also, you need to document for each activity you've done, how long do you spend doing it, right? 
Um, some activities we think we're only spending 10 minutes on and we're spending an hour on. Guys, that's the equivalent of having, uh, again, having a car missing from our dealership and not even knowing it's not there. Next, you're gonna look at every single activity and you're gonna label it if it was planned or unplanned. You know, throughout the day, you know, as soon as you hit the showroom floor, there's 70 different random things that come your way. So how many of them are planned and are unplanned? It's amazing what you'll find out when you label those. Step five, we're gonna determine how profitable our activities are. How valuable are these activities? Um, only by knowing what we want to accomplish most. What, what, is your, what are your primary uh, desired outcomes? And then only then can you rate the profit level of each activity. So go ahead and do that on a scale of one to 10. Next, you're gonna label energy versus stuff. Energy versus stuff is going to help you figure out what you like to do and what you're good at. That's energy. If it's stuff, if it drags you down, if you procrastinate it, if someone else does it better, then that's stuff, okay? The next step, we're gonna do what, what I call do, defer, delegate, and delete, okay? And we're gonna combine. I call this C4D, okay? Because basically, um, there's some activities you can combine together to save time. There's some activities that might be stuff for you and energy for someone on your team. You need to delegate that out. And then low value activities you need to delete, okay? Next, we're gonna take all these different activities and we're gonna start block scheduling. And what I mean by that is you're gonna to go to one day schedule and you're gonna label energy versus stuff, energy, stuff, energy, stuff, okay? Starting with the highest value activity to the lowest value activity. That way, at the end of the day, if something does get pushed off, it's your lowest value item, okay? Also, throughout your day, make sure you schedule in unplanned activity time since you've done a documentation of how much time you plan or how much time you spend doing unplanned activities you can take that and you can plan that in your schedule so you don't overcommit. and then finally once you get good at block scheduling you're going to actually build out your routine that's right every single day of the week every single day of the month has a planned regimented routine starting with the highest value activity finishing with the lowest value activity, making sure you factor in unplanned activity time. And last but not least, and most importantly, even after you build out this routine for success, okay, you still need to forgive yourself when I fail, when, when you fail, because no one gets it perfect. So listen, what you just learned is pretty cool, but it's only a small piece of our trademark Drive C3 performance coaching framework. Drive C3 often helps dealerships increase sales by 30, 50, or even 75 cars and the best part it also lowers stress gives you more time with your family and helps you motivate and communicate with your employees even better right now i want to give you another gift i want to give you a 30 minute gps or goals purpose significance strategy call with myself or one of my coaches in addition when we have our gps strategy call i'm going to throw in this get it all done workbook you see on my screen this GPS call, we will help you uncover what you want most in your business and your career, identify potential hidden blind spots to your success, and help you create a clear path forward. I believe the best way to help someone understand effective coaching is to give them effective coaching. My goal is to give you such an impactful life and business changing conversation that at the end of our conversation, when I ask you to make it official and start you as an official coaching client that you'll say, you know what, Sean, I'd be crazy not to receive your coaching. I am so confident in my Drive C3 coaching framework that if at the end of our call, you don't see massive value, I will personally come to your dealership and give you a free sales meeting. As long as you're in the lower 48 states or maybe I'll just buy you lunch. But I'll warn you, it's been three years and I haven't had to buy a lunch yet. Remember, this isn't for everyone. I want to make sure the right people reach out. Uh, this is for dealer principals, GMs, sales managers, BDC managers, or anyone else who wants to grow their business success, income, sales, spend less time frustrated, stressed out, scraping at their goals on the last day of the month. Click below and book a time that works for you immediately. Thousands of people watch this video. Leaders have started signing up to receive coaching and learn from us almost every hour of the day. And as the number one automotive coaching agency in the business, availability is limited. 
So click the button below and book a date and time that works for you right now so that you don't miss out. So click that button and book your discovery call now.